Hi, Virgo. All right, let's see what is showing up for you, Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. If these are general messages, so take what resonates, leave what doesn't. We'll see what is going on for you, Virgo. All right, first card out is you may need to make a decision. You have the fork in the road card. So let's see what this could be about. It could be about a lot of different things, but a tower, strength, the wheel, and the devil. Okay. It may be time to do something new or different. I get that there's been some sort of change in your life or upset, something that you've had to deal with here. Um, devil just makes me feel like it's outdated thinking, negative thinking, doing the same thing. Maybe it's time to do something different. Knight of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. This may be time to go out on your own or do something different or get kind of crazy or do things that are, you know, I don't know. I feel like some of you also, the devil represents something unique you want to do. And it could be a really good idea. It could be something about, you know, making money or someplace you want to move or a relationship or something. It may be time to make that move or decision. Virgo, yeah, look, look what's under the deck. Follow your heart because I feel like for some of you, you're kind of going along with um, the norm and what you think you should do, what people want you to do, but you're not really doing what you want to do. And I feel like that's important. So, I mean, listen to your intuition, but, you know, follow your heart is kind of what I'm getting right now in your reading. And you have to make this decision. I feel like you kind of know what you want to do, but maybe it makes you nervous or scared. Let's see. Yep. New love, Ace of Cups, Eight of Wands, the Five of Pentacles, the Star Card, and the King of Wands. Some of you, there is a fire sign that's very important in your life or coming into your life. They could be new. This could be something that's destined on your path. And with the Star Card, it tells me that it's, you know, could be a blessing. It, um, it's something you don't see. Someone may see you as feeling out in the cold right now. Five of coins. Or this just may be how you feel. Yeah, justice. New love. Could be somebody that you know. You may feel stuck right now, but there will be communication. Wow. Page of cups. So for some of you, this might be an Aquarius. We also have Libra. So they might be an air sign. Um, this is somebody who... Okay, so it could be someone new brand new ace of cups is here or a new relationship with somebody that you do know it could be something okay you also feel very stuck i'm sorry the messages are coming through a lot of them you may feel stuck right now five of coins eight of swords and not see the out this person may be that person who gives you that message you need to hear who tells you how they feel who opens up again it could be brand new love so i do feel like you may know this person have talked to them already page of wands is here Knight of Coins, looking at the past. I feel like this person misses you because I feel like there's some sort of communication messages, something between the two of you at one point. And now they're kind of like waiting and looking and remembering that. But show me something else. Spirit with this connection. Page of Coin, wanting to talk to this person. So I feel like there's going to be a lot of communication between the two of you. <clears throat> what do they think about you, Virgo? Eight of Cups, letting something else go, moving away from something is a good idea. I am getting for some of you, there could be something that's unhealthy in your life, an ex, a job, something that maybe it is time to let it go. Probably not maybe, probably it is. Um, so I feel like this person's rooting for you and they really care for you. Their name could start with an R. I'm getting like a Rick or Richie or Richard type of name right now. Um, they could have... Oh, they could have... I'm seeing like a sandy blonde hair, but I'm also seeing dark hair, so... They, I could, I can also get like they could be someone who is athletic and may like to go to the gym or work out or things like that, or maybe they're very opposite and not. But I feel like the two of you would have fun. You guys have a lot in common. Yeah, nine of cups. I feel like this is starting with the fact that this person cares about you. There's a lot of love here. That's what I'm picking up, and they care about you. So again, like this will help um, if you possibly get out of a situation. Maybe that you be, you've been feeling trapped in. Uh, let's see if we can find out something else. I'm going to go to a different deck. I'm going to go here. What does Virgo need to know about the situation? I'm also getting for some maybe, maybe it is time to move out of state. It is time for you to make a big leap when it comes to what you're doing. You're not happy and maybe it's your career or the job you're in. You could also be getting an offer to do um, something very creative is what I'm getting as well. A creative project, something maybe you want to work on. Something like that, but let me see. What is going on for Virgo? So you have someone is hurting and in agonizing pain. Wow. Okay. 
that we have is believe in the right timing. So this can be physical pain, this can be mental pain, this could be you, maybe you're feeling out in the cold, but something is changing here with this believe in right timing. This is coming in at the right time for you because maybe before you wouldn't have seen this person, you wouldn't have taken this offer, you wouldn't have noticed it. So one more for that. At a crossroads. So again, having to make this decision of having this be on your path, I feel like it's going to be very clear, the communication, what this person is saying to you. What else does Virgo need to know? It's like the right place, the right time, um, some sort of offer thrown. It says a position of authority. It's an interesting card to come out. So what else for Virgo? You have the arrow card You're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life and you are guaranteed success in this situation. Wow. One more fill out. Hang on. You also have sun. New creative ideas, new ventures, and a fresh start. Okay. So again, for some of you, this is probably love. This is a person reaching out. You may know this person. They could be brand new, but this situation is coming to you right now because you're ready for this, you're open, you don't see another way out or you don't see another path. I shouldn't say you don't see another way out. Um, you can do other things, but this communication, right time, right place, kind of show you the next step of what you're doing. Okay, let me grab, I'm gonna grab this from this deck and see what it says. It says, what you commit to brings fortune and fame. You have the golden touch right now, wow. This could be a relationship that flourishes. This could be a relationship where you're in it for many years. I do see a lot of fun and happiness, like I said. This is a soulmate connection. I feel like it's like, again, justice, being um, ready for this, being open at the right time. Oh, Tell me to pull another card here. Yep, serendipity. That's the whole thing. Right place, right time. Being ready. Eight of cups, time to go. It's time to move on from something. Show me something a little bit more of this person's spirit. I'm looking for my romance. Here it is. Romance deck because I feel like for romance, what does Virgo need to know? This is a past life soul relationship. It says you've known each other before. That's why for some of you, yes, you do know this person. You've met them. You've talked to them. Others of you, this is a past life soulmate. But they're a brand new person and you need to make the effort. This is important. Stay optimistic. This person has been put on your path for a purpose. You are meant to be with this person, to talk to them, to move forward. This is to help you out of a situation where you feel stuck or alone. So it's all about um, divine timing, things working out for you. Um, this person is coming in as a king. They may also be maybe an Aries for some of you specifically, but all right. I'm gonna leave it here, you guys. Have a great weekend.